What's up everyone? Welcome back to the 12 days of chaffles. On day five, we're gonna make what I'm gonna call a cinnamon toast chaffle. So obviously we have some cinnamon and this is gonna use a, a base recipe using two thirds of a cup of this uh, pizza mozzarella. It's appreciated in a, in a bag. If you wanna use fresh cheese, that'll work just fine as well. We got some extra cheese to go on top of the mix. And we're gonna use some of this uh, Swerve brown sugar sweetener. And of course, one egg. So we're gonna start by mixing the cheese uh, in with the egg. Get that good and mixed up first. That'd be a good time now to uh, Hit that thumbs up, subscribe if you like these these kind of videos and make sure to turn your notifications on so that you don't miss the next video. So we're gonna add some cinnamon here. Now again, this is entirely up to you how much you add uh, to taste kind of thing. So this is a teaspoon measuring spoon. And as you can see, it's just over half a teaspoon of cinnamon. And then we're gonna add in some of this brown sugar or brown sugar like uh, zero calorie sweetener. And we're gonna put in two teaspoons of that. Again, this is entirely up to you how much you put in. Uh, you can put in more or less. Although I wouldn't put in much more. Um, you'll find, and we'll see this at the end, whenever you're adding a sweetener like this to chaffles, it tends to take a, a fair bit longer for them to cook through properly. Uh, so I probably wouldn't add much more than this. So that's the mix all ready to go. So we've got the Dash Minis all warmed up, ready to go. So we're gonna distribute the mix evenly in each of the waffle irons. Now I completely forgot to put uh, some cheese down first but they still turned out fine. Adding a, a bit of fresh cheese to the bottom of the chaffle iron will just help the, uh, the bottom of it crisp up a little more. Um, but like I say, they turn out just fine. So we're gonna put a little bit on top here. And then we'll close those up. Now, like I said, these took quite a bit longer to cook, uh, probably almost twice as long as a regular chaffle, but they did turn out quite well. Um, they're fairly soft when they come out, but if you let them sit for a couple of minutes and cool off, they get a little bit firmer. And as you can see, that uh, sweetener gives them like a brown a cinnamon toast look to them so yeah that's what they look like uh, I was really happy with the taste of these and how they turned out uh, it really did remind me of a cinnamon toast from when I was younger so yeah so that's it stay tuned for day number six tomorrow until then keep on thriving <laughs>